Well, the triangle has claimed yet another spot in a top list of notable places, this time for the cost of rent. Yeah, out of the 50 most expensive zip codes to rent an apartment in North Carolina, the triangle has more than half. That's according to the website Rent Cafe. New at 6, our Carly Griffith is digging deeper into the new average rent prices and whether the average person can afford it. North Hills new Park Central is renting one bedroom starting at nearly $1,500 a month. The two-year-old Sky House in downtown Raleigh rents a similar size starting at around $1,800. People like me who make a decent salary, a standard salary, I can't really afford a $1,000 rent. Randall Bodie lives in West Raleigh, zip code number 36 on the top 50 list. When he and his wife found an affordable apartment four years ago, they took it, no questions asked. 1,000 square foot apartment for $755. Oh, you definitely can't beat that, so we hopped on it. We didn't even look at the apartment. Brenda Vinerich had a tough time finding affordable rents, too. She works in downtown Raleigh and rented there for a couple years until it got too expensive. A lot of the rental prices there and the rental houses have gone up. Um, it's really hard to find anything under, I would say, like 900 now, even for a one bedroom. The North Carolina Housing Coalition says around 45% of renters in Wake, Durham, and Orange counties are cost burdened. The average apartment rent in Wake County is around $900. By comparison, the NC Housing Coalition says the average salary can afford $750. I don't think it's their intention to exclude people, but I think that that is what's happening. I think it's not really realistic, the prices that they're charging in terms of rent. In Raleigh, Carly Griffith, CBS North Carolina. We also reached out to the Raleigh Housing Authority and the Wake County Affordable Housing Steering Committee for comment today. We'll be getting answers from them tomorrow on what's being done to bring more affordable housing to the area.